SLE in Antioch, Tennessee, look at a white V-neck uh, concession trailers, uh, eight and a half by 16 foot. Let me take a look at the start at the beginning. We have, you see that it has an extended tongue. On top of the tongue, we have a 100 pound propane cage. Next to that, we have a 36 inch access door. And take a look inside. This gives us access to all our plumbing. Right here we have a 30 gallon uh, fresh water tank, our water pump, and our two and a half gallon hot water heater. Right here we have our breaker box for a 100 amp electrical package. This trailer features a 24 inch stone guard that wraps the bottom of the trailer and then goes up the front of the v-neck. We're going to go uh, down the passenger side. This trailer features uh, two 3500 pound uh, Dexter axles with brakes steel wheels or white steel and or radial tires and so we have a uh, towards the rear we have a four foot concessions window with sliding glass and screens and it has a fold down uh, serving tray to the right upper up part of this window we have a halogen uh, floodlight to the rear we have another concessions window this window is five foot with sliding glass and screens this also has a fold down serving tray at the top of this window there are two halogen flood lights one on both sides this trailer also features uh, scissoring jacks uh, on all four corners take a look down here we can see one there and then one on that corner and then we have two more at the front This door has a, also has a halogen floodlight to the right. And go in. This door also features a screen. So we look on the inside. This, uh, this trailer features aluminum mill finished walls and ceilings with ATP flooring. This trailer has an interior height of seven foot. We we'll walk in, we look to our immediate left. We have our, uh, part of our sink package, we have our hand sink, which is nine by nine and five inches deep. Then to the right of that, we have our triple sinks. Each bin in this sink is 11, or 15 by 15 and 11 inches deep. It also features two 15 by 15 washboards on both sides. Above our sinks, we have an eye level shelf that goes to front of the across the front of the V-neck. Underneath our sinks, we have uh, two cabinet doors. These will give you interior access to the plumbing. This is what we looked at outside. Uh, the walls and ceilings in this trailer are fully insulated. So we look, we have the countertops in this trailer are stainless steel. We have a counter that goes all the way like an L shape. 
And we see the inside of our four foot window. And then our five foot window. Right here we have our five foot commercial style grease hood with an enclosed light. Under that we have our uh, tabletop. And next to that we have our three drawers. These drawers have a locking mechanism uh, so they don't just swing open right here. If it's up, it means it's locked. You switch it over to the right. It means it's unlocked and you can pull out the, the drawers. Get back and you can't pull. Right by the door we have our interior and exterior light switches. And then there we have our hood vent switch. This trailer also features three interior uh, fluorescent lights going down the middle of the trailer. And then the, uh, the third one, right above the sink package. This trailer features our AC and heat package right here. All right, we're gonna exit the trailer now. See you around the driver's side. Right here we have our drainage for our 50 gallon wastewater tank. Also on the driver's side we'll have our, our city freshwater fill box.